Hello, I'm JW. This time we'll have a look at sockets, and by sockets we're meaning these things, the standard deal in the UK, socket outlet or socket, and these are the BS1363 variety, commonly used all over the UK, and these have been the standard since 1947, that's over 70 years ago. And uh, the main point of this video is to see about the uh, shutter arrangement inside, as in across the line and neutral pins here, and various different ways that these can be implemented. So this is the uh, UK socket here, the BS1363, and here's the plug that goes in there. So three pins obviously to go into the three pins there. And so these have been in use in the UK since 1947. Prior to that there were various other ones, mostly with round pins. And of course there was a fair bit of overlap as well, so even after 1947 there was plenty of properties that had the round pin ones installed. And in fact you can still buy some of the round pin ones today for specialist applications, but uh, in general this is what you're going to find in pretty much every home, office and other business in Britain, and that's been the case, say, for many decades. And uh, unlike uh, some other countries, all plugs in the UK have three pins, and there are no two-pin versions, despite what we saw in that recent video where there was that despicable uh, weird adapter thing. And uh, since 1947, when this was introduced, all of the sockets have had to have shutters across the line and neutral pins here, and so that's been required from the start, so nothing new there. Now, the usual way that these work, certainly on the cheaper brands like this piece of junk here, is that the shutters are opened via the earth pin. So when the earth pin actually goes in, then that will actually open the shutters here, so the other two pins can, of course, go in there. And have a look at the plug, see the earth pin is longer, obviously for the purpose, so it can open those before these actually make contact. So on this cheaper socket, if we just take the uh, plug here, then of course that fits in just fine. On the other hand, if we take a thing with only two pins, this is one I've just removed the earth pin from, I'm trying to install that in there, and that pretty much uh, not going to happen. And uh, so that's simply because of the shutters contained in the socket, and uh, so there you go, it just uh, basically opens those. Now of course the problem with those is that someone could just get a screwdriver or other prong and just uh, cram it in there, and open those and shove in some inappropriate plug in there. And if you try and shove the round bin euro plugs and other things in there, it generally damages the contacts inside and breaks the plastic around it, leading to a total disaster. So not something you should be doing. However, there are other types of uh, shutter arrangements. And uh, here's one of them. This is a Hager socket. And this requires that all three of the pins are actually present. So as before, if we take our normal size plug, that goes in no problem. If we take our two-pin job and then try and shoehorn that in, well, pretty obviously that's not going to happen. If it's got the earth pin here, we can see the shots in there not particularly well because they're black, but on this one if we push the earth pin in, notably the shutters here do not open, so you can't just shove a screwdriver in and, uh, and put other stuff in. However, if the earth pin is inserted and then we get the other two pins, then those will actually then go in. Of course that's being stopped by the things sticking out, but of course without that there's no chance of that happening. So this is the Hager one. Now MK also make one uh, very similar arrangement to that. Here's the MK one, this happens to be a double one, and it's very similar to that uh, Hager one. And again if you put the uh, earth pin in, shutters here do not open. If you try just with the uh, two pins there, Again, they're not going to go in, and no, it doesn't make any difference which way up they are, because they're both the same size. But if the earth pin goes in first, then the two pins here will open those, so you can get them in there. So again, this modern MK socket does require all three pins to be present, and this uh, is what it looks like on the back. It's uh, say a fairly uh, commonly available item, made in the UK in this instance. And the Hager one looks surprisingly similar on the back, uh, similar kind of plastic colouring and whatever, although uh, of course it's made by a different manufacturer. And again, see up here it's made in the UK by Hager, so uh, there's a couple of examples of uh, decent ones. Now in a previous video where we saw that dreadful adapter, uh, a number of people suggested that some of the older MK sockets had a deal where that if you had two pins they would actually open the shutters, no earth pin was required. Now, of course, they haven't actually made those sockets for quite some time. This uh, type here with the curve is called Logic Plus. I think this came out in the mid-1990s. Prior to that, there was a series called Logic, and that was the one which uh, allegedly had that uh, two-pin problem. 
Now, of course, we don't necessarily go and buy those, but we do have one of those things here. So this is the older Logic series. And we can see the shutters are white in this case, and they're a different shape as well. So uh, there it is. This one has never been used. There's a bit of a chip out the bottom, unfortunately, but still got its original screws and everything else on the back there. And again, made in England, it says here. And of course, the same standard, 1363. So uh, let's see what happens with this one. Now, if we hit the uh, single pin here and shove it in the earth hole, let's see the shutters do not open. So that's pretty much the same as with the uh, more modern versions. So the question is, if we take this uh, two-pronged plug and shove it in, will these open without the earth being present? So let's see. And the answer is, yes, it does. And it goes the other way. So these older MK1s, which were sold certainly throughout the whole of the 1980s and uh, most of the 1970s, do not require all three pins, and therefore you can take one of these flat things and uh, just shove it in there, no problem whatsoever, with no earth pin installed. And of course it still works with the earth pin in place as well, because that doesn't actually change anything by its presence. Now, of course, the thing namely is that can you shove one of these, that is the uh, European type of effort, into there without putting the earth pin in place? So uh, let's just see if that will work. And the answer is not really. It gets about that far, and then that's kind of it. So uh, no, it doesn't just shove in there. Oh, very difficult to get out of there, so we may have just jammed something up in there. But uh, no, shoving a uh, round pin European plug in does not work even on these older style MK. And have a look at the actual pinholes there. You can see they are shaped in a particular way, so presumably designed to only work with the flat bladed items and not therefore with the rounded end things like those. So though you can put one of these in here with no earth pin, it only works with one of these. It certainly uh, doesn't work with one of those. So what about the uh, cheapo matic socket? So of course what uh, certain unscrupulous people might do is to shove something into the uh, earth hole here, open up the uh, shutters there, and then take their non-standard plug here and then just shove it in. So does this work? Well, it kind of does work. So it does go in there, but it doesn't fit particularly well, as you uh, obviously would expect, and it is a very tight fit. But uh, nevertheless, on this type of socket with just the earth pin opening thing, Yes, the European plugs can be rammed in there. Of course, that's not recommended because uh, these things are typically on a 32 amp circuit. This flex clearly is not rated for that. And of course, shoving these in there will eventually damage the uh, contacts inside. And of course, could easily actually break the front of the socket off as well. So uh, not really recommended there. And again, the uh, Hager one won't go in with that there. Even if you put the pin in, it sort of goes in, but again, it's the same deal as with the older MK there. It doesn't uh, particularly work, the shutters seem to jam. And then with the new MK, even with the uh, thing in there, again, you can kind of ram it slightly in there, but huge amount of force required, so uh, not something that's going to happen. And of course, without the earth pin in place, you can't actually get anywhere at all. So a selection of uh, sockets there. So uh, new decent ones, as in this Hager and this MK one, do require the presence of all three pins to actually open the shutters and uh, work correctly. Older MK Logic, which say from the 1970s, 80s and early 90s, does not require the earth pin. You can just shove it in the uh, two pin holes. But anyway, that's fairly unlikely because all UK plugs have three pins. The only way around that is to uh, deliberately remove a pin like I've done for this demonstration. So again, not a particularly likely scenario. And of course, the uh, rest of the market with the cheapo matic variety can easily be defeated just by shoving any object in there, whether that's a uh, pin or screwdriver or whatever else you have to hand. And then you can just ram in there, misshapen and inappropriate things all day long. So uh, there we go. And uh, that's pretty much it for this time. So until next time, thanks for watching.